Well, the anticipation is over, and now the big day is here. It's the final of the UEFA Europa League. I'm Derek Ray, and as always on these big occasions, I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. We're on the cusp of kickoff. It's Arsenal, and they face Villarreal. Well, the long road from the start of the competition almost a year ago to the final is here. Both teams had the added advantage of if they win this competition, a Champions League place is available. And so the starting 11 for Arsenal. Bernd Leno stands between the posts. Thomas Partey starts with Mohamed El Neni in central midfield and getting the vote of confidence in attack today, Alexandre Lacazette. Villarreal starting 11. A towering presence in goal in the person of Geronimo Rulli. Danny Parejo starts with Francis Coquelin in the centre of midfield. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. It is the Europa League final, and they are underway. Bukayo Saka. Manu Trigueros. Now with Alcata. In behind for him to chase. And just slightly offside. Martin Odegaard, El Nenny, Lacazette, on to Pepe, Martin Odegaard, Thomas now, El Nenny, moving the ball effectively, looking for the right moment. Well, couldn't keep it. Cocola and Alcázar and he read it well intercepting it Martin Odegaard Nicola Pepe Thomas patient build up at the moment Bukayo Saka well possibilities in the centre Nene, can they nudge in front? There it is! How about that for starters? Well, what a huge moment that might be for this club. The fans are going absolutely wild. Well, here it is again. The through ball is perfectly timed. It causes havoc. And sometimes, with all the time in the world, you can fluff your lines. But he composes himself and slips it past the keeper beautifully. One nil then.
Parejo. Pedrasa. Coquelin. And here's Gerard Moreno. Thank you. El Nenny. Saka. It's with Erdogan. Well, high marks for that pass. Crossing into the middle. Well, it was pretty straightforward for the goalkeeper. Alcatar. Coquelin. On the ball to Puese. And beyond the last defender, offside. Martin Erdegaard. Elneny. Thomas. They've won back possession. Juan Foyt. The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. And they are on the move again. Crossing possibilities. Still behind, but the pressure mounting. Coquelin. Beautifully timed. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Given away by Arsenal. Coquelin. Fight has it. It comes to nothing in the end. Saka. Martin Erdegaard. Well, possession is the watchword inside their own territory. Now they're on the scent of something positive. And a chance, Erdegaard! And a goal! Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box, just begging for someone to get on the end of it. And then the sheer power of the strike, really impressive. It's a thunderbolt. Second goal for them here. Manu Trigueros. Pau Torres. And here's Gerard Moreno. Now, do they mean business on this occasion? And just like that, they've lost possession. El Neni. Bukayo Saka. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. Arsenal have given it away. The first half draws to a close in this UEFA Europa League final. And let's face it, Lee, this has been an utter mismatch. Well, an A-plus on one side and a D-minus on the other side. And surely something's got to change. Got a bit of pride to play for. Just remember that badge that you're wearing on your chest means a lot to the fans out there. The quest for Europa League success and the second half of this final is underway. Manu Trigueros. 
Paco Alcázar. Now Parejo. Coquelin. It's with Parejo. Moreno. And a fine tackle. Nicola Pepe. Parte. He made it look simple, really. This looks promising. That's a useful cross. Danger averted. Parejo. And he takes it on. Oh, it's a save and a half from Bernd Leno. Well, you can see what the manager thinks. They just haven't been clinical enough today. And firing it into the area. That's all they can conjure for now. And a throw-in it's going to be. And time for the change now. Chukweze, Gerard Moreno, Parejo, and here's Alcácer, just cutting off the supply. El Neni, Thomas now, and breaking at pace with Menes. And teammates to play it to. Xhaka. A super tackle and they've won possession. Juan Foyt. Now with Alcata. Pedraza with it. And the defender got the last touch. That'll be a corner. <laughs> Substitution time it is. And perhaps a bit fortunate not to be shown the yellow card. Different story next time, no doubt. Corner kick played in. Well, it has come to nothing. Excellent first touch under the circumstances there. So, 20 minutes to go. Good tackle. It'll be a throw. Parejo. Cocola. It's with Parejo.
Moy Gomez. Coquelin. Well, now in a dangerous position. Wonderful block. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Martin Erdegaard. Thomas now. Nicolas Pepe. Splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Xhaka. Pepe. Thomas. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. El Nene. Now Aubameyang. And a timely intervention. This might be the perfect counter attacking opportunity. Pedraza. Now Cocola. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Wonderfully weighted pass. Obama Yang. Space and time for the cross. Will he finish? And finishing there with more of a whimper than a bang. Derek, that reminded me of you. Finishing like that, it's just terrible. I wouldn't have done that well. <laughs> Thomas. Well, no luck keeping possession. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Getting forward. Parejo. And a creative look about this. And there's the whistle. This UEFA Europa League final has been decided. Disappointment on one side, but sheer jubilation on the other. And my goodness, Lee, they deserve it. Absolutely deserve it. They were running the clock down at the end. The referee obliged and blew his whistle, and quite rightly so. They're now on the halfway line celebrating with all their teammates. I'm pretty sure all the subs, etc., will come running on as well. A great, great night for this football club. That's a party to last throughout the year, I should think.